Venom vs. Spider-Man, Kevin Feige won't rule it out Venom and Spider-Man could happen anytime, says Marvel boss Kevin Feige. Audiences may one day see the two Toms Holland and Hardy come face to face in a Venom vs. Spider-Man movie, says Marvel Studios president, Kevin Feige. During a recent interview, Feige responded to the idea of the Sony and Marvel worlds colliding, saying simply that he wouldn't rule anything out on a potential crossover. While his comments are a long way from confirming anything, the very fact that Kevin Feige does not rule anything out is exciting enough, and surely Venom can only be kept away from Spider Man for so long. Feige went on to say that a lot of the rumors fans have seen online could well be things that come to pass eventually. Kevin Feige's comments do in fact go promisingly well with recent comments made by Sony Motion Picture Group president, Sanford Panich, who even suggested that a plan is already in place for Venom and Spider-Man to meet on the big screen. There actually is a plan. I think now maybe it's getting a little more clear for people where we're headed, and I think when No Way Home comes out, even more will be revealed, Panich revealed. The great thing is we have this very excellent relationship with Kevin. There's an incredible sandbox there to play with. We want those MCU movies to be absolutely huge, because that's great for us and our Marvel characters, and I think that's the same thing on their side. But we have a great relationship. There's lots of opportunities, I think, that are going to happen. While little is currently known about certain elements of the plot of Spider-Man, No Way Home, we do know that Benedict Cumberbatch will return as the Sorcerer Supreme, Doctor Strange, and that he will join Tom Holland's Peter Parker on his latest adventure. The character is said to be taking on the mentor role previously held by Robert Downey Jr. as Tony Stark, with the movie looking more and more likely to be following on from the upcoming Doctor Strange sequel, Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, and throwing Peter Parker and his chums into the multiverse. Opening up the MCU to the multiverse would certainly be the easiest way to bring Tom Hardy's Venom into the fray.